Hello guys, in this video, I am going to introduce you to this fascinating research, which is Quiet Star. According to this Quiet Star, language models can teach themselves to think before speaking. This research is based on top of this research, where the title is Think Before You Speak and Training Languages Models with Pause Tokens. This new research takes this think before you speak large language model paradigm to a next level and that is the whole focus of this video quite star in very simple words represents a step towards language models that can learn to reason in a general and scalable way by training on the rich spectrum of reasoning tasks implicit in diverse web text rather than narrowly specializing for particularly trivial data sets. Star points the way to more robust and adaptable language models. The results demonstrate that the promise of this approach with Star improving downstream reasoning performance while generating qualitatively meaningful rationales. The researchers also believe that this opens up many potential future directions, for example, one may aim to ensemble thoughts in order to further improve the predictions of future tokens. Moreover, if the language model can predict when thought will be useful, for example, by putting the mixing head before the prediction, then the predicted mixing weight could be used to dynamically allocate compute during generation. Future work will definitely benefit from this awesome research. If you go through this paper, the crux is that in writing and speaking, individuals often pause to reflect. While traditional views on reasoning suggest it serves to answer questions or fulfill tasks, it's inherent in virtually all forms of writing. This include the implicit steps in mathematical proofs or the assumptions in conversation. The self-taught reasoner demonstrates that learning to think effectively can come from analyzing and drawing lessons from a small number of examples, particularly in question answering context where the goal is to find the correct answer. But this approach is limited. Ideally, we want language models to deduce unwritten reasoning in any context or text. Their development, Quiet Star, expands on Star by training language models to formulate rationales with every token to better predict upcoming text. They tackle several challenges including the high computational demand of producing such predictions, the initial inability of language models to generate or utilize internal thoughts and the prediction beyond mere text words. Their solution includes a new sampling method that processes tokens in parallel, the use of special tokens to mark the beginning and end of thoughts and an enhanced form of teacher forcing. This method particularly aids in predicting challenging tokens and enhance the LM's capacity to directly answer tough questions. After further training with Quietstar on a broad internet text corpus, the researchers have shown this improvement on the benchmarks too, which is defined in this paper. Now, one of the quotes they have put it in abstract is quite interesting, where the sentiment is that understanding life requires looking backward, even as we live moving towards the future. If you look at this diagram, this is quite interesting. In this one, as I mentioned earlier, the researchers are visualizing the algorithm as applied during training to a single thought. They generate thoughts in parallel, following all tokens in the text, which is in the think one, the first. The model produces a mixture of its next tokens, predictions with, a, with and without a thought, or in other words, talk with two. They apply reinforce as in star to increase the likelihood of thoughts that help the model predict future text while discarding thoughts that make the future text less likely. There are a lot of other cool things happening in this model. For example, as I just mentioned above, there are three main steps, parallel rationale, generation, think subsection, and talk, and then learn. And we just saw it in the diagram too. All in all, pretty good paper, I should say. I think there will be a lot of work in the future on top of it. I will drop the link 
so this paper and video description let me know what you think and if you like the content then please consider subscribing to the channel if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching